Hi, I'm Dean Argent, a university qualified mechanical engineer and I'm the owner of usedvehiclesales.com.au and in this video I'm going to show you why I hand selected this really neat and tidy 2003 Mazda 6 uh, as one of the cars for sale here on my yard. So um, as we walk around here I'm just going to show you some of the things I look for when I purchase the cars, this one including. First thing I like to look at is the tyre condition. And as you can see under there, now I know it's only a tyre, nothing to get too excited about, but you can see that it's wearing neatly across all the surfaces. Well, that shows me that all the suspension geometry and stuff like that's working nicely. And that's reflected in uh, when you drive it, you feel that it's driving nicely. The car drives beautifully, all good, everything's good with it. There's a few minor blemishes, they're only cosmetic, but I'm going to step you through them anyway. If you have a look on the bonnet, oh, it's so small you can't even see it, but... There, 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 see there how the thing, like where I am, hello, <laughs> just there, there's like that thing, that's it, like go back here, can you see it, Whoop. so if I didn't tell you, you probably wouldn't know it was there, but I like to sort of point them out anyway, there's, um, you know, there's a couple of minor things, like little dents like that throughout the car, but they're only like that, they're minor, nothing serious that you'd need to, that I'd need to mention is something that would, you know, upset you, for example. So, because it is a used car, you know. So, um, come around the back here. It does have a little little thing on the back bumper there, but it's such small paint fade. I'm not even going to focus on it because it's just so small. Yeah, it looks like the fuel flap thing works because I was test driving it before and I test everything on the cars. And the fuel flap's one thing I test to make sure it's working, and it's working. <laughs> um, have a look down here. All in very straight, very show, very neat condition. Basically all good all round. So there's the external walkthrough. You can see the general condition of the car. It really is really, really neat and tidy. Mazda reliability, all that stuff in the automatic. So let's jump in here and take a look. You got the power everything. So power windows, power mirror, locks the back. That one there locks the kids out. <laughs> um, the cockatoos agree as well. <laughs> no goggles. Uh, we've got the cruise control happening here. We've got the let me put the uh, keys in it. I'll show you. We've got the radio volume control. Where's the keys? Got too many pockets here. <laughs> there we go. No, it's not even those ones. Should be a little more organised. There it is. No, it should have less pockets. That's what it should be. So if I turn the radio on and oh, I need to set the. Thing, uh, the bit going, you can, I reckon so you can operate door from there. Uh, an origin game that will be up. remembered beyond uh, volume down, uh, mute if you want to take a phone call or whatnot. I'll start her up so you can see. So 211,000. Well, that's good as gold. All the lights and stuff go out. Just a matter of putting it out of gear. Oh, and then there's the driver's seatbelt, which I don't have on at the moment. So. But yeah, everything works nicely there. Um, what can I show you here? Got the Bing, got the radio system, the whole lot. Oh yeah. Here we go, going on there. With there was a turn it down. With here's the setup here in the automatic. So the cigarette thing there. Got the track seek and the APC. Were you looking for the APC? Don't know what it is. <laughs> Me neither, <laughs> but it's got it. So, uh, got the compact disc thing, where is it? Written so small that you can't even see it, but it says compact disc something. And if you look in there, six stacker. Beautiful, so you just jam them in, one after the other, after the other, after the other. And what else we got there's all the controls for it there. So looking through the car, all in pretty good condition. Uh, you know, it's a used car. I'm not going to pretend that it's a brand new car because this one's not. But it's uh, in all round pretty good shape. So there we have this 2003 Mazda 6 with... You can see how the seats drop down like that as well. So if I hop over this side, uh, maybe this won't work because of the seat belt. You've got to unclick that with a key or a screwdriver or something. Um, oh yeah, that works. But you can see in there how that all comes together. There we go. 
So let me just run you through a few of the things that happens here, what, what works with this car. So all the cars that come from here come with, the price includes a six month warranty. Uh, sorry, the price includes six months rego. So what you're gonna come, what you're gonna see is that that big fat number plate there that says warranty is gonna be changed to a Queensland plate and you're going to see uh, Queensland Reg on that. The price includes stamp duty, transfer fees, all those things across to your name. The price also includes a fresh service. So before you take delivery of this car, it will have a fresh service where you won't need to service again for scheduled maintenance for the next 10,000 Ks or six months. Guaranteed clear title, never been in an accident, a crash, anything like that. Car drives beautifully, all good. And oh, that's the other thing, 12 month roadside assist. So I'll include that. So what that means is if you get a flat battery or a flat lock out, flat tire or lock yourself out or something like that, then you just um, make a call to RACQ and then they come and fix it up for you. Uh, that pretty much summarizes everything that comes with the car. I've got all of these things here listed on the website. So if you need help with your finance, uh, we might be able to help you with that as well. Just follow the links or send us an SMS and, and we'll send you a link to that on the website. Sorry, we'll send you a link to that on the SMS. I've just left my phone up there. <laughs> um, and that's pretty much a summary of everything that's going on here. My name's Dean Argent. If you want to come out and inspect the car or come and kick tyres or come and kick me if you want, <laughs> come on out and do so. Um, I'm open for business. I'm, I'm uh, in the business of trading cars. I'm not in the business of collecting them, so that's why it's priced so cheap. So if you'd like to come out and inspect, buy it, whatever, give us a call and it can be yours in a very short period of time. Thanks for watching and hope to be in touch soon. Bye for now.